In 1788, a church was constructed just to the north of the old village, which was in time to become the National Cathedral. In 1865, the cathedral was renovated, yielding the design and appearance it bears to this day, with two exceptions. The upper gallery was removed when the new organ was installed in the 1970s. In the 1960s, an extension was added to the east to accommodate the church secretariat and the sacristy on the ground floor and in the loft, a meeting room for the church council, and a small room designed to house the equipment to record and broadcast the Sunday worship service over the radio. From around the year 1000 until the Reformation in 1536, the churches in the Faroe Islands were part of an independent bishopric. Subsequently, they came under the bishopric of Bergen, and then later under the bishopric of Copenhagen. In 1990, the bishopric of the Faroe Islands was again re-established, whereupon the historic church located in the heart of Tershaun was designated as the National Cathedral. In addition to the regular worship services and the various church services conducted for the local congregation, the National Cathedral also serves as the venue for special worship services, such as the ordination of priests and the annual Aula Soka worship service held as part of the Faroese national holiday on the 29th of July. On the national holiday, members of parliament, representatives of the government and the priests of the country walk in procession, led by the bishop, the president of the parliament, and the prime minister, from the parliament building to the national cathedral for a special worship service before the Faroese parliament is again convened for a new session. Thank <laughs> you.